Some students out in Beeville got quite the culinary experience this week and organizers of the Uncommon Chef competition say the Food Network type event teaches kids about sustainability and learning how to cook. Our Chris 6 anchor Taylor Lanise has that story. Three, two, one, start! These little guys and girls, man. Hey, young chefs in the making, Gordon Ramsay, you know, hey, bring it. On Saturday, Bee County kids from kindergartners to 10th graders chopped, stirred, and sizzled their way to a culinary paradise. And you can smell all kind of flavors, all kind of spices. All sprinkled into the first annual Uncommon Junior Chef competition. When I was their age, I was not cooking like this. I didn't know asparagus from a leek from Italian sausage versus beef. Honey, Placed into teams, competitors are given a box full of mystery ingredients and are given a set time to make a meal of their choice. I need to be able to cook and chop up stuff and make meat and stuff. Dr. Deval Patel, the owner of the Coffee Barrel, started the new program as a way to teach kids about sustainability. It's about helping the environment, thinking about clean energy, it's about how you make an impact on health care. It brings communities together. Most of the ingredients are from local growers like Jean McElveen. Our new generation of people learn how to grow, learn what to do when, it, when it's ready, how to cook, and just being a, a stewards of the land. Alongside McElveen, our very own Rodero McMurray judged the competition on taste, appearance, and creativity. It was exciting and it was fun and I was happy to meet a lot of new people and make friends. Some of the prizes included being guest judges at Dr. Patel's next Uncommon Table, a special session with Atomic Baker, right. or a private dinner. If we're not doing this through fun, exciting ways, kids don't realize it, and they're missing a major opportunity for the next generation and their kids. Taylor Alanis, Chris 6 News.